One of the things the AIS always tries to do is you know, really stay at the forefront of cutting edge technology that can keep athletes uh, healthier uh, and uh, happier in their training environment to make sure we give them a great platform to perform. And uh, back in 2019, uh, the AIS executive gave the go ahead to invest in point of care PCR testing, a device that's not much bigger than a shoebox um, that can be transported into the field so that when we've got touring teams, we can uh, test them and get a result for any respiratory or gastrointestinal pathogens in about 45 minutes. It sort of turned out to be the, the, the right project at the right time. And it's been at the, the Olympic Games, the Paralympic Games, the Winter Olympic Paralympic Games, um, and then now we're getting ready to head over towards the, the Commonwealth Games. For athletes, particularly in a game scenario, it doesn't have their, their day disrupted with having to go off and get testing, waiting for results, isolating. The athletes really appreciate it in a game setting because of that. Right now, probably the AIS has the most expertise in Australia in the use of this technology in the field, like as a mobile technology moving around. The pandemic is far from over, so we're going to continue to utilise this technology. And also, even once the pandemic is over, again, we go back to the basics that illness in athletes really has an impact on performance. So using this technology to be very specific about diagnosis, very targeted with our interventions, and uh, very sure of our isolation procedures um, gives our athletes and our coaches a platform to perform and hopefully, uh, as we saw in Tokyo, you know, bring home uh, a swag of medals.